so guys Jay here and um, here we are <laughs> I'm kind of thinking this is to be a bit of a redemption arc frankly especially for how bad yesterday's um, experience went but not to worry we shall try our best right let me just explain what has happened like I said I've managed to level up everyone to a decent amount uh, hopefully that's enough um, the main idea is we're going to be using Ruby here because they actually have Shadow Ball and obviously with it being Vaporeon it's the tankiest member of my team at the moment especially when it comes to special attacks and it's HP and I might even see if we've got any EV boosting items to try and help juice him up I need to remember that Ruby's a he not that there's anything wrong with that and frankly, I have just not been able to sit still knowing how bad I left it last time. Hmm, I thought I would have had something. And I do also have a secret weapon if things go wrong. But that said, uh, thing that might go wrong might need, uh leveling up okay it does seem like we don't have any EV boosting items we do have some X items though which we might have to consider using all right and also if things go wrong uh, King also has sucker punch for that Gengar and I frankly think that might be the only solidified way we can actually defeat that Gengar. Sorry about that. Well, I don't know if I'll ever use that cracked pot. Hey, maybe the focus band might come in handy. I think if anything, I'll just snoop around and see if there's any items I can grab. And then there's only one other thing to do after grabbing this TM. Pray I kind of got it right. Then a shock. That's actually really good for Luna, actually. Luna needs a special attacking poison type move. Especially for the gym after this one. Oh, they didn't have Venna shock. I thought it was base 80. 
I know it gets double power when it gets, um... When the opponent gets poisoned, but... These guys are gonna do great. I know it. It's just me that's the problem. You, give me ball. Still be able to take care of the initial gym leaders running up, so. Either that or we'll use King. Spooky. Mine is zoomed in. Feels nerve wracking, man. Why not? <sighs> they were riding on little sinisters. Yeah, sinisties. Okay, it's 
simple. It's a simple process of just eliminating. Of course you'd have Shadow Sneak. Okay. Priority moves too. Okay, there. Another pumpkin wolf. Easy. Please stop doing that, thank you. Okay, uh, I think I'm making this more stressed on myself. to think that in the sword version it's punching gloves. This thing can be very bulky if it wants to be. I'm fine with that, I could just use Ice Shard for a minute. Slide, and we're done. I forgot how annoying this puzzle can be. Wrong way. I think it's obvious to think, but I think the fighting type is a lot easier to deal with than the ghost type. Especially in the situation I'm in.
This I need to be careful with, because even like this, Haunt is very dangerous. Never mind, I forgot it's a thrill. Gengar is a different story though. I'll switch to King for this. Do I have a no no I don't have a normal type. Look, the one time you don't attack. <laughs> I love that move animation. I like think it's exclusive to that move or something. There. I'm gonna try and juice up some guys before I get into this. Aqua Ring. No. I've already got the leftovers on it. Dog balls. I'll get rid of Torrent because I'm not going to be worried about any like, repeating moves, I guess. Oh, it le evolves at level 35. I thought it was 36. I guess I better get the Rillaboom uh, gift ready. I was hoping for this moment to be a bit more climactic, but oh well. Big monkey. Not fun. Good and laugh. Drum beating. This is going to be a good move for a while. Okay. Rillaboom has a dark type move. I think maybe I could start off with uh, Funky Kong for the first bit. There. I'll leave it at that. Confuse Ray. No. Okay. Now I know what I'll start off with. I'll start off with Funky Kong with him being bulky. And I think he does start with a Galarian Yam Mask, so that works type advantage wise. I'm not going to use Emily at all in this because it's a Litwick. I'll maybe consider using him, using her in easier fights, or when they've evolved into a Lampant, and then later on a Chandelure. This is it. This is the whole reason why I've been stressed out the last few days.
Okay, no joke. This is just me as a Pokemon trainer. Just someone really shy. Extremely shy, man. Off of a drum beating. Very nice, funky call. I have an idea for this. It'll look weird at first, but... Okay, that's fine. It'll paralyze it, but it'll also bust the disguise. Hit slash here, so and just to make sure I know what it will do, I'll protect just to make sure I know what it's going to do in front of a ghost type like a frost slash. If I knew it was gonna do that, I would have just gone for Shadow Ball. Oh shit. Okay, good for us, good. Very good. Thank goodness that was a crit. Alright, Frost, good. Very good, Frost. Alright, we'll use King to deal with Forced Curse alone. I think I should be okay since I outspeed Cursula. Yeah, good. And now here's where things get dangerous. That's fine, I'll be switching out and get rid of the curse now. Wish me luck, lads. That is why I was worried. It's quick. Mm -hmm. And that's why I'm using max 
Axe Quake. It's amazing, my special defense. to HP. <laughs> Yes! Vaporeon is shot off to be the second big evil. I'm sorry, but you can never be a Jolteon. Oh, well done, Ruby. You saved us there. Uh, Luna's learning Discharge. Well done. Oh, I, 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 my plan worked. My plan worked. I'm. <laughs> wow. My. A plan of mine worked? Uh, that's the ghost patch. Hex. <sighs> wow. Um... Okay, I'm actually kind of shocked that worked. Okay. Next we'll be facing beads, so Luna can stay out of this one. Last thing I need is losing another really good member. Especially since we're about to face the fairy gym soon. Alright. Let's go. have a look at my boxes to see if there's anything we can add to the team because we've got a lot of overlapping types well when I say that I mean just we've got an overlapping of ghosts yeah we're kind of limited on types for some reason We gotta try and sort that out at some point. Man, let's go beat up that little brat. Yay, more money.
This is gonna be fun. Emily's Lunge Shadow Ball. Lovely. Right, we have an encounter. We have some encounters in the wild area to do after this. I know just where to go as well. Try and mix it up, it won't follow the formulaic path I've made myself. Yeah, keep telling yourself that with your pinky pie shit. Top marks, Frost. Top marks. Let's go. I think we've gotten that momentum back. And yeah, I haven't even had to change the team member yet. Eh, 420.
Okay, so obviously we've done this bit, this bit, this bit, and this bit. Instead of going to these two, we're going up to here, the stony wilderness. Either that or the bridge field. For our encounter. <clears throat> Wrong button. I'll put uh, Luna up first so we can get the paralysis going. We'll do our counter here in Bridgefield. Okay. Unless we do over there. Okay, we'll do the Stony Wilderness. Okay, our encounter will be. That I can't paralyze. paralyze. I'm getting Luna out of here. I'm getting a lot of ghost types in this. <laughs> that pose he did, that was funny. Question is, does he have Iron Fist or Klutz? Because if it's Klutz, that's a bad thing. I think I know the perfect name for him. Omega Supreme. Iron Giant it is. This might have been very useful during that gym. Right, we'll keep this in the box for now, because as I said, we've got too many ghost types at the moment. And our random encounter will be... Barboach. Another ground type I can't paralyze. Ooh, critical catcher. That helps. Alright, not the most exciting catches. But they'll do.
There aren't many female fish characters, are there? <laughs> it's based on a catfish as well, so... Tiny nose. <laughs> There's a good chance I'm never going to use that barboach. Whisk hash does not have that much to like for it. Oh, it got clutch. Nature. To explain about what happened last week, um, we grabbed King from a static encounter in the Glimmer Tangle. That means it's outside the encounter table for the Glimmer Tangle. So, we are allowed another encounter in that area that we're going into next. And frankly, I'm hoping we get a decent fairy type like a Hatram. Hatram would be very useful right now. How did I find a bar bush in the grass? Glimwood Tangle can counter will be a Shinonic. Something we don't need right now. Naming him Ed. Make me think of Ed from Ed and Neddy. Mm. 
and they ain't gonna whip me. Still has a way to heal itself after I taunted it. Wow. At this point, this thing's not worth it. Still gotta catch it for an extra encounter, don't I? That was horrible. No, I would not have enjoyed using that. Right, let's just grab some items. Let's just see how bad the situation is when it comes to Ankara. I could have had a phantom. I don't need a phantom because we're going to build some grass.
Hmm. That other encounter with Shinonic kind of proved to me that Emily can easily take on a Shinonic. Enough with the Shinonics already. Like shit -otics. upsetting. Actually, Orangaroo would have been amazing at the gym. Well, maybe not. I'm thinking about it. I do need a bit more diversity in certain types.
Ooh, high horsepower. Yeah, that that'll be good. In fact, I might have a way to get around that wheezing now. This dupe's close though, so... Luminous Mulse. Boost special attack if the holder is hit by war type attack. I think that's good in those locks. Let me know in the comments if that's true. Alright, next gym. This one I'm not exactly as stressed out about. Because it's a very much easier. Stupid red Pokemon again. Nothing really worth it. <laughs> That could be useful. That is such a weird stat distribution. Like, Morgum's more of a special attacker than Grimson also a physical attacker. Yeah, 
Morgrim's got 75 base special attack, but 60 physical attack. Yeah, when it becomes a Grim Snarl, it becomes a physical attacker. So weird. Would have been nice for it to have Prankster. I'll wait until it's a Grim Snow, because then I've got a reason to get rid of Dark Pulse then. Luna's going to be carrying this gym, at least for the first good bits. There's something I gotta do first. It'll be funny. And will be useful for certain Pokemon. interrupting our conversation. If I bring out Dusclops again, that'll be basically what I'll be using. But for now, we'll be put onto uh, Emily, so they've got a bit more defense. Which they desperately need. I think Revenge would be a dark type move. No, revenge is usually a dark thing you, you do. <laughs> Something I need to consider maybe using. Fiend if it been killed my car call. I'm coming for you, bitch. <laughs> you, oh, now.
Okay, bet. I do know that Mawile's not really that powerful outside of its Mega, but I still think it's kind of dangerous for me to put Emily in front of it. I may put Ruby in front of it just in case. supposed to put uh, Luna up front. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello, Chair. Why not? What are you doing today? We're just, uh, cur <laughs> we're just currently going through um, our Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke. Uh, hopefully we're going to be able to get through the Fairy Gym today. We just finished the Ghost one as well, so... Uh, yeah, let's get uh, Luna in. And if anyone has any ideas about what the nickname theme is for all our Pokemon, please feel free to ask. Okay, Slurpuff. This is basically not a challenge. <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you very much. I am doing my best with or without the affiliate phrase. Yeah, I, I don't. This gym isn't even gonna be a challenge. The only thing I may need to think about is how I'm gonna deal with the Marwile and Weezing, because they're not weak to, you know, uh, steel and poison. Well, obviously Weezing is, but I don't have any steel type moves. We should be very good right now. They, they, these chan these like people I have to fight, they do not look happy. I you think what happens in that film Coraline like, forced to smile. Or that other film that actually just called Smile. There we go, that swear looks dead. Aromatis. We'll get Luna out again for this one. Uh, I think it was Annette. Yeah. Now just one finish shot might be good. There we go. I really hate Slurpuff and Aromatis. Really horrible looking Pokemon. Yeah, I've officially caught up to Opal's uh, ace level, so this is not going to be a, a hard fight. The Gengar one had some time thinking about, especially since we lost um, the line noon I was going to use against it. More grim. Indeed it, indeed it is. Unfortunately, I haven't bumped into my favorite Pokemon during this Nuzlocke yet, so... It's just... Like, 
I just don't like the way the Slurpuff and Romatis look. It's horrible. Alright, since we're gonna get a Gardevoir out. Oh, mine is Noibat. But I personally realize that um, it wouldn't be a good idea to grab a Noibat right now, especially since we're not that at the point where it's easy to get access to a Noibur. And have you seen Noibat's stats? Almost. I'm, I must say, like, I thought that this Foss, or well, I caught the Snow Run, yeah. I was thinking it was not gonna get far. It has been doing very well. It really has been. It, it, it's gone as a lot further than I thought it was going to, because it, it's an Ice type, it's not exactly the fastest um, Ghost type out there, but it's been doing a lot. I'm honestly shocked about it. Ugh. The only thing is my my uh, Litwick Emily t obviously takes a while to evolve. They're close to getting to Lampent, which means we'll be getting a Chandelure soon. That will be very fun to use. Especially during that Ice Gym. Alright, that should be it, and now it's time to face the Witch herself. <laughs> But yeah, I really do like Noibat and Noibran, but with me doing a Nuzlocke, I could tell that it's not the best idea to grab it yet. Because, um, as you can see, I have a lot of bloodshed right now. It was very, very sad when that happened. Alright, fairy types. We're facing with a Weezing first, won't we? It would, but obviously with it being a Litwick right now, it, it can't cope against that right now. And I I don't have any rules against the level cap, but I do, I'm trying to stay under the level of their, either at the level of their ace or under to keep it somewhat challenging. That's why I haven't even gone to the Isle of Armor to get the experience charm. Uh, if you're interested, there are the rules for the challenge as well. Okay, for wheezing, I think it might be an idea to just start off with Funky Kong, because the only poison type move that wheezing knows is Sludge, which is like one of the weakest poison type moves out there. So, I mean, obviously, Funky Kong here is very tanky, so we'll have to see how it goes from there. Weezing, Weezing and Marwile are the only problems in this gym. Togekiss and Alcremie are a joke. I'll say that. Sorry for the ding. And yes, since we're doing a Nuzlocke, the story is not being considered. You know what would have been really good here? If one of my encounters was a Honage, that would have been really good. I forgot it has levitate. Scrap. Alright, let's work with this. You are leaving the fight. Well, that's gonna be knocked out straight away. Right. I'm just gonna have to use. I'll use Ruby. Ruby's tanky enough to deal with whatever it's got.
Yeah, good. I think it was a really good decision to make uh, my Eevee a Vaporeon. There we go. Price is averted. Nice crit skull as well. There's a bit of a jump scare getting my starter half health like that, honestly. Oh, uh, tier 1, um, how's my um, voice compared to the gameplay as well? I'll keep uh, Ruby in with us. I don't want to risk losing the Funky Bomb. Okay. Just stalled again, I guess. Why this is very easy. Now let me see if I can lower it down a bit then. Is that better? If not, I'll just turn down the volume in the game and set them. Oh, that's good. good. Right. And uh, yeah, now it's time for Luna to sweep the rest of the game. Yeah, I'm. I'm I always ask this for anyone watching my uh, nose block, but are you able to guess what some of my names are references to? He's finally kicking in, and not a moment too soon. And yes, this is the gift Toxel you get given on um, daycare. Reach for the sky. Yeah, this is going to go up on YouTube, by the way. Say was the fact you can't turn off the experience yet. In my opinion, X and Y got it perfect. The fact that you can leave it on and your Pokemon will get experience, but you have the option to turn it off. That was when it was good. That's when I liked the experience share.
I've only recently managed to get my setup ready for um, doing stuff like this with Pokemon. So I need to at least get my Pokemon up to level 40 by the time I reach the next gym. Alright, that'll be no problem at all. Alright, that's a new gym done and that means two more encounters in the wild area. No. Not really, no. I didn't do any speedrun. I don't think I'd ever be able to be successful with speedruns either, so... Honestly though, Luna stole the show there. I will put King... Right. I think the plan is to add a bit more diversity by replacing Frost with whatever our next encounter will be. Oh god, you're in that town. There's nothing wrong with that. I needed to do it for fast travel anyway, so. Oh god, I mean that means you need to deal with Expresso Depresso soon, doesn't it? Ever heard of a brush? <laughs> I honestly, like, this is the one character I hate in the entirety of the game. Chairman Rose is like, the so Chairman Rose is the Sonic 06 of this game. He's bad because, he's that good because he's bad. This guy is just bad. He's, he's like the Sonic Forces of this game. Should I make that the thumbnail instead? <laughs> I, should I actually make that the thumbnail? Welcome back from Ad Town. I really wish it wasn't as bad as that. Like I've been trying to deal with it for a long time now. All right. Two new encounters in the wild area. Here we go. Let me see. Oh, is that all that stuff with the US election still going on? I know I'm not in the same country as all that, but I actually want that uh, Kamala Harris to win, frankly. Okay, so I've done that one, that one, that one. Oof, good luck. Good luck for, to Kamala. I, I know I'm not uh, much into political. But I just hope Kamala actually gets in. Will Kamala Harris be the first uh, female U.S. president? I, I can't. I'm again. I'm not in turn with presidential history, but it'll be a big day then. A really big day. Last thing we need is after the Cheetos covered bastard Donald Trump back up there. Okay, so we've done that one, that one, that one, and that one. We haven't done those two. Or that one. We've done that. I think we'll go to the Giant's Mirror for this.
So as the ruler has said, we will get two encounters from one spot in each area of the wild area. One roaming, one random. Then we have access to both encounter pools. So we need to go into the giant's mirror for this. Which apparently we are in. Okay, we're in the giant's mirror. I have decided not to. I'm allowed to go into the dens to grind for materials, items, and experience things, but I'm not accounting the catches. Like, I, just, I don't catch them at all. It makes things simpler that way. Alright, our roaming encounter will be... That is actually Dupe's Claws. Because I actually already had a Butterfree. It was actually our first death. Let's try that again. Okay, I guess we're doing the random encounter first then. The random encounter is a coffin with neutralizing gas. Trying to think if we could actually use that, because we've already got the fairy type. Oops. Again, I keep forgetting that um, for some reason, Gr more Grim is a special attacker when Grim smells a physical. Okay, let's try that again. Roaming encounter is. Jesus Christ. A Tranquil. Uh, it's a... Uh, I needed a flying type, I guess. I just hope it has super luck. This was a really bad... This was a really bad group of Pokemon then. Because one is a repeat, one is a bad grass type, and one is this. What was in the, um... The random encounter upper move pool, because obviously we got coughing, but that didn't go well. Right, I need to think about a character that is known to be a female bird character. Yeah, I still got King to level 39. Shaira. Yeah, like, well, it's, it's a pigeon, but I highly doubt I can get myself a Braviary anytime soon. Like, the theming of the uh, nicknames is animated characters. So it's from games, anime, movies, TV shows. Yeah, I'll name I'll name her Hawk Girl. See, like Funky Kong is from Donkey Kong, King is from the Owl House. If you watch that, 
Frost is from Mortal Kombat. Luna is the name of one of the members of the... Uh, yeah. Luna is the name of one of the members of the Hex Girls from Scooby-Doo. Emily is the name of the Corpse Bride from the film Corpse Bride. And Ruby, because... Uh, you know in the show Ruby, uh, she has that giant sniper rifle and she uses dust of different elements. Yeah, we'll get rid of Frost for the moment. It's more for the fact that it, we might need them in the future. Hey, think of uh, Hawk Girls like a scapegoat. So I need to remember to get um, Unpheasant and as well as uh, Tranquil. But luckily I've been able to store a few uh, experience items so I can juice her up. It has to be the female trunk that I have an on pheasant as well. Why did I die? And yes, I do this every time I get a new team member on my team. <laughs> It's not the end of the world though, because uh, we will have some more encounters in a bit. It does have super luck. Alright, might be something to keep an eye out for. Yeah, there's a good chance I'll be using Hulk Girl as like a, a scapegoat. Just checking if I can learn anything worthwhile, because it is an unpleasant. If it was up to me, it would have been called unpleasant. Unpleasant and unpheasant. But it is not the end of the world. But out of curiosity, I want to see what I could have gone from here. Like when it comes to the random encounter pool. Now that would have been a dupe on types, but that would have been good. There's not much of a big move uh, pool of Pokemon here. Not to worry. Right, let's get going to the next two encounters because we've got Ru 
the route leading up to the ice gym and then that massive temple area. I kind of have a bit of a limited nickname move pool, haven't I? Because. Like, what would you have named a female pigeon when it came to animated characters? Ooh, what's that? Believe me if that actually shocked me. <laughs> exactly. It's the best thing I could think of was Hawk Girl. So I'm gonna be fucked if I ran into a Braviary later on, because that'd be a perfect name for it. Or maybe I should name it Shaira. Sorry about that, I was just throwing something up. Because obviously um, I make YouTube videos of the stuff I do here. Oh look, it's Espresso Depresso. Let's see if there's anything I can get from here. Like they get TMs in these ones, so or not. I guess it's time I need to head to the graveyard. Now I might need to warn you: the following uh, scene might be disturbing. Yeah, it's quite bad. I lost um, Jewel the Butterfree when I was battling a trainer with free timber. I found out the hard way that timber can learn rock throw. I lost my card call and um, growl lift to the first fight with Marnie when I was I kept getting flinch trapped. By um, by that stupid more pico. It was not fun. Rocket and Froppy here. They were killed by the fact that I was under leveled during a team yell encounter. And um, depth charge here. He was the most painful death. I was trying to level up in response to losing Rocket and Froppy, and I found this Gengar roaming about. So I thought, oh, it must be like 10 levels above me or something. I can use that for quick experience. It was level 60, and I failed to run. One waterfall, uh, one dark pulse later, and. And um, Jinx here, Arena Trap Duck Trail. Yeah, it didn't end well. 
It was really painful. <laughs> That's kind of why I'm doing this now. Usually I do this on Saturday nights, but I just felt terrible leaving it like that. I just felt like I needed to get some momentum again. Luckily I have, but ugh, it just was playing with me the last few days. Alright, let's deal with Espresso Depresso. And yes, that's what I'm calling Hop, because he goes through that really cringe depression phase, doesn't he? Ah, Hulk actually has a good matchup against us. But doesn't have a special attack. That physical attack. to think I could have had a Corviknight. <sighs> Imagine how useful a Corviknight would be right now, but no, I had to get a Squirrelville on Route 1. Berserker wouldn't be the worst thing right now. Hey, Corion. I think the plan is to try and evolve Emily into a chandelier before we get to Melanie's. Snorlax could be a problem here. I, I didn't remember that they had a Snorlax. I can't remember what this... I don't... I can't remember what Snorlax learns. Because if he's got the high horsepower, I can't even think about bringing in Luna. to the burn chance. I 
I need to research. That, that's why. That's why I'm quickly checking. Like I can't. I can't not check. I can't not like switch until I know what this Snorlax has. This is too dangerous. Interesting. He doesn't have bite. He doesn't have crunch, but he has heavy slam. We're sorted. That was a close one. But that was a risk I had to take. Only problem is though he's properly beefed up in defenses, so unless I get a crit, it's gonna take a while. Himself. I couldn't risk it. He could have had high horsepower. I'm just gonna keep hitting flamethrower until I get crit. It's more specially bulky than physical. The burn is doing more damage than, than Emily is. I right, can't bring in King, can't bring in Ruby. I'm gonna have to try and use Funky Kong. He's bulky and he has been burned. Yeah, we're fine. And just for safe measures, I better have to screech him. You'll either make him more vulnerable to getting hit, or you'll use waste of turns on um, stockpile to get him back up. I think the burn finishes him off now. Man, that Snorlax was tough. We could have I could get a Snorlax. Alright, it would be clean to finish Intellion off now as well. Actually, better be safe and sorry, I'm gonna switch to Luna. Cause I don't know if they'll have Ice Beam or something. Okay, I over I overfought that, didn't I? Poison jab, no, special attacker. Mm. 
Yeah, that would be an idea. So I don't rely on skulls as much. And after all, now we've finished with that uh, ghost gem, I don't have to worry about Gengar anymore. At least for a bit. Okay, now it's time to get a few encounters. Okay, let me see, okay. Just go back a bit. Our next encounter will be... A battle. That's annoying. Why is this weirdly working with Bolt Girl? Let's go back and try that again. Okay. Our next encounter will be... A more Pico. This is the thing that killed my flipping torque in my car call. Part of my it's part of my rule set though, so I need to catch it. I, if we catch this, I'm gonna nickname it Brain, as in the pinky and the brain. Gee, Brain, what are we gonna do with my? The same thing we do every day, Pinky. Try to tickle for the world.
Well, there goes the Route 7 encounter. I kind of think that was a good thing, though. I actually don't see why I could have done with that more Pika, really. I just hoping I get a more viable counter in that route down there. I might go back and see if there's another move Hawk Girl can learn, because obviously un unpleasant as a physical attacker. Um, overall, uh, tier one. Do you think the stream's doing? Like, does the stream look visually all right? Just double checking. Good to hear. Stay away from the graveyard. These are the only moves it has learned. Wow. Unpleasant is really terrible. Like, the only physical move it could learn there was quick attack. The sooner I get rid of this thing, the better. You have to forgive me, I have been advised to do regular stretches due to a muscle spasm in my right arm. Oh, we could have had a really cool Lipard. Say, the Lipard wants to come with me. I would have been named it Kipo. Route 8 encounter. Let's back up a minute. Okay, let's try that again. Our next encounter will be... A Baldor. Is anyone interested in helping me with a trade? Because honestly, that could be really useful. Especially for what I'm hoping for for the final fight. Huh? I better check my Discord. Honestly, I think Gigalith is a great idea. Inferno. Not it's not reliable enough. Nasty plot, no. Yeah. I'm gonna be using this. Ooh, 
what's a good rock related animated character? The thing? No, that's more of a comic character than an animated character. Then again, I did use Hulk Girl. Nah, I don't like that idea. Um, Cole. I like that name, Cole. Hey, if anyone's ever watched Ninjago, yeah, Cole. Whoops, <laughs> I need to do one here. Yeah, Cole's a great name. See the summary? Oh, that is a really bad nature. But it'll do. Sturdy is very useful though. Like, one of the best abilities during Nuzlocke from what I've heard. Lullaby, would you have minded if I just saw that out quickly? Hello. Hello. Uh, let me just try and move your head on the overlay because you're underneath the stream radius thing. Oh, I'm an oh, okay. Uh, just to explain things, chat, uh, this is one of our mods, and they have agreed to quickly help evolve my Baldor into a Gigalith. I might need to turn you up a bit. That is a very occurrence for you. Right. What is the code? Code two four zero oh, one. Two four zero oh, one. Two thousand three. It should be good. If I got it right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Go teach. Oh god, I forgot about these Chinese Zelandics that I got. You were Shannon to for Zelandic, weren't you? I have so many. This is the one thing I don't like about this is I Oh, I do have a shiny surrounded the fuck? Let I'm me not guess. shiny, but I have a female one. Oh. Yeah, I have a bunch of shit. I don't know, don't know what I've got. I'm just glad I've been able to reclaim some momentum I lost from yesterday. I mean, uh, Saturday. <laughs> like, Thank God, at least. My Grim, my uh, more Grim and Litwick are ready to are very close to evolving. We're evolving this boulder I just caught. In the, in this? That's crazy. Say what? What are you say? To sleep. Sorry, I woke up the cat a little bit. Ah. He just yelled at me for no reason. 
Oh, uh, tier one, do you want a link to our community Discord so you can keep up for when we're, I'm doing this again? When we're doing silly shit? Yes, yeah, very silly shit, especially when it comes to stuff like Monster Hunter, which we'll be streaming when it comes out in February. February. Sweet. And luckily, this Baldor didn't have the stinking Everstone that Baldors have a famous reputation of holding. <laughs> what is everything for? Honestly, Baldors keep, for some reason always hold Everstones when you have all them. Mm. Well, just kind of grab something. How ironic, I already had a Morgrim. Yeah, now you get a one that you can't use. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, I'm trading it back because I want the Gigalith back. Yeah, I know. Let's pick something random and went, let's go for it. I just hope it doesn't have the experience boost because it just sets my ADH, my um, OCD off when something's le leveling up higher than the rest of my team. I know, it's a little silly sometimes. I guess I have two of them. And then just throw your way. I for a moment there was like, why the fuck is it called code? Oh yeah. It's a reference to Ninjago. Mm. You know the Earth Ninja. Yes. <laughs> Did you notice your Morgrim has two stats at sixty nine? Does it actually? That's kinda of crazy. Have I have a look at it as well, that's the thing. Have a look when you get back to it. Wahoo, Google. If I get that thing up with okay. body press, hey, I think I'm just swinging. Have one of those? Well, it's a trade evolution. <laughs> why wouldn't you? Mm -hmm. I mean, why would yeah. you? There you go. Thank you very much. And now I can get rid of that stupid hawk girl. Mm. Yeah, I tragically have been given a. Oh, another one. I was, I was tragically given a. Um, an unpheasant as an encounter. Have your dog back. Dog? I don't know why I called it dog, it's not a dog, but I called it dog anyway. <laughs> I don't know why. Welcome back, Cole. Okay, now that saying welcome back it makes you think that I won't get the experience boost that I don't want it to have. I don't think you will. Although its energy blast can blow away a dump truck, they have a limitation. They can only be fired when the sun is out. Oh. So Gigalith is a summer guy. Well, that seems a little silly. It's just a little bit. Right, it's going like it. brown for the rock type. This could be really helpful for the ice gym. It could be poggers. Yeah, oh, that's, that's I, have a, a... I have a thing. I have a thing named Earl. It's a, I don't know what what level are you at right now? Uh, in the forties. But obviously, with me doing a nuzlocke, I can't take what you might have there. I know. I I had a stuffle named say, named something. I don't know. Like yeah. stuffle, How stuffle can stuffle die. Okay. Well, too bad. Stuffle's great. Please tell me I have the body press TM because that'd be amazing for Gig for Cole. That'd be kind of cool if you did. Kind of level up the most. Other than it's not Jacifer, I suppose. <laughs> then stupid. Stealth Rock oh. would be amazing. I'm teaching it Stealth Rock. I got a lot of my Pokemon to uh, what is it called? Can't remember. A, why do I always put oh of course still having up that's actually kind of upsetting just doing a little bit oh well aha welcome no cool 
Yes, uh, welcome Taiwan. I hope you'll enjoy our Discord. We try our best to be as active as possible. I just sort of sit there half the time. Get over there. You know what's really icon I ironic? The level I caught this get this Baldor is very, very in the middle of where the rest of my team is now. So I don't have to grind it up. That's not too bad. Oh, I could have gotten a poniard. Bishop would have been cool. Probably. Oh my god, a cat. I shook myself a little bit. Let me just I'm raise your volume up again. Thing. Very weird oh that my. you're so quiet. Uh, why well, am I on my phone? That might be why. Which means next time you're on your proper thing, you're gonna be blowing my eardrums off. Alright. It's not your fault. I'm gonna get all my Pokemon for the first Pokedex so I can get the Pokemon thing, but I don't know how many more I need. Because I'm stupid. Well, if you're up for that today, I can help you work on that when I'm done. Okay, this isn't a good matchup because I don't want to bet him or poison move. Mm. Maybe I move your little icon to the left, the right side. Oh, me and my hee 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 hee. Hello, Pinky. Anyway, if you like it now. Ah, that would be good. Oh, yeah, I'm doing this. I ain't denying that unfe unpleasant could be good, but honestly, it can't be. Because it's more Pokedex. Oh, why did I get something? What did I get? I have a lot of Pokemon. I'm missing something. I'm missing... Something. Oh, with that stupid fucking thing that I don't have. Okay, that's gonna annoy me. I have a bunch of shops that I've beat up and they're just not caught, apparently. So I'm stupid. I but I've seen them. I forgot that Hatrim doesn't become a psychic type yet. Oh, we got four viewers. Hello, how are you doing, guys? Oh, fucking Saruwed. Fuck you. Oh, I was, I was trading. That's what I was doing. I have forgotten how to put away some of my shit in Pokemon 3, but it's Jake is just out there. I don't, what are you doing to me? I don't want to know. Let me surprise trade the rest of these uh, things. Well, just, so many well, just all those hack shiny Pokemon websites for names. Yeah, I get a bunch of those, and I'm like, cool, that's a new thing. I always just take, I always just take the Master Ball off them and release them. They never have a Master Ball anyway. It's usually a ability boost or hmm. something else boost. Can't remember. What it is. Oh, it will change your Pokemon into something else. You don't think you? Okay. What about that? I don't have, I don't need a Dusclops, I have a... What's his pre-roll for me now? What the fuck is that? My problem half the time I don't know what any of the Pokemon are, and then I see it, and I'm like, what the fuck is that? Uh, do you reckon oh, it's another shiny thing. Pog. Registered though, which is kind of foggers. That's the only good thing about surprise trading, it just fills in your Pokedex accidentally. Yeah, that's why I keep doing it. 
Mm, you got heavy duty boots. That's you take them then. Smart strike. It's never a master. I have nine master balls now from Chinese writing, but I don't have them anymore. Like I still have them, but I'm like I don't know what to use them on. I haven't found. What Pokemon can even learn Smart Strike? Is every time I try and learn it, my Pokemon can't learn it. I know it's always annoying. You're like I want this thing, but then you're like, actually, I can't have this thing, which kind of so. Oh no. Oh, what did I run into? You're teeny tiny. Oh, it's a little okay. It's mainly for Pokemon that have horns. Yeah, you'd think Giggle. Oh, and then half your Pokemon don't have them? Yeah. That's just the way. You'd think Gigalith would count, though, because that's a horn. Come here. Get in the ball. It doesn't help that I'm doing this in the tummy thing. Yawn, please. I do asleep. I honestly really do feel like playing some more um, Monster Hunter now that we've played that beta. Like, I might be going a world after this. We do need to f get rid of um, that Fatalis, don't we? Why do you yawn on me? It doesn't matter anyway. So I can wake up still yawn. Haha, -ha, you're asleep. You could have gotten a Gortus here. I could have had a Gengar. Would have been nice. You could still catch it. That's not like no. That's not how it works for a Nuzlocke. First capture of the root, and that's it. Or in my oh, case, or in my case with the um. What I'm doing, I get two encounters in the mm. wild area after every gym, and that's it. The only exception to that is a shiny. That's not what I want. That's not what I want. No, not Poke Portal. Although I did get some there, because I'm too big. What am I getting for this fan fee? I swear to god, it's another fucking uh big boy. I swear to god. What the fuck is that? Oh it's it keep getting a regular Pokemon and like a a normal ball. Hmm. And then I keep going, why? <laughs> because it's not a hacked option, it's literally just someone trading you over a Pokemon they caught. Yeah, but every time it's like a normal Pokemon, it's it's quite literally just a thing. Let's put away the final item. Uh, and get the fuck out. Good, I could have been useful. Probably, but... Yeah. Looks like say most of my Pokemon are Japanese. I'd expect that from a Japanese game. Like, most of them? I would say, like, a lot of them are Japanese at this point. There's nothing I can do about it, but... No. I'm getting rid of most of them anyway. Honestly, what? looking at my I've team... My looking at this team, it's actually starting to turn around. Like, this looks like a powerhouse team now. I didn't really kill one of them. Don't jinx it, please. I already, I already jinxed it last week. Why'd you think there's so many... Sometimes foreshadowing is relatively obvious in my videos. Yeah, since you people beforehand you go, oh, this can be easy. And then it's not. <laughs> I have to walk though. That's fine. There should be one more encounter before the ice gym. But I don't think there's a problem with that now. Where did that come from? I don't remember that. Okay. Don't remember doing that. One thing that would be absolutely nuts is if in some way I got a Dragapult. I'm thinking, uh, shiny. 
like shiny Pokemon from New Zealand, because then I have to go check in there. I'm like, I'm pretty sure that's not a shiny, but I have to check again. It's the worst. I know. I actually I got one that wasn't uh, from a from a Pokemon thing, and I was like, oh thank God, I just keep that. Which is kind of nice. And at the same time, I'm like, mm, get out. Electabuzz. I like the sound effect of Zing Zap. I didn't think that well, did I? It's fine. More or less, not I, gonna do much to you. I should have really went to Funky Kong, at least then he could have used high horsepower. Okay. Does that guy have yellow teeth? Is that the, yellow teeth? Is that what the Japanese think we Brits look like? I think that that's what they think, uh, Japanese, like, <laughs> what are they called? Fucking, uh, rappers. I think that's what they think they look like. I've never really thought of it that way. I think even if they, they just don't know any rappers as well, they're just like, eh, and it's sort of there, isn't it? Do we even have Go any- for it. Do we even have any rappers? Like, I know the US have loads of them. I know there's some. I wouldn't say a lot of them have gold teeth, though. I think that'd be a little weird. Who am I getting for this fan team? Right, there's, there's a static crustal here that will give me a TM behind it, so... I need to kill this crystal. And yes, I would have called it Mr. Krabs if it was if it was able to be caught. The French insect Professor Elemental. I've never heard of them. Who? Uh, apparently someone in the chat just said Professor Elemental, best rapper ever. Do you have gold teeth? I, I, I don't know. know if, I don't know if he has gold teeth. Tell you one, because he does he have gold teeth? I have no idea. I'm gonna look it up. Fighting trousers, apparently. Fighting trousers? What? That's what he said. What am I getting? Okay. Apparently it's a guess that he doesn't have gold teeth. No, he do not. Okay, for some reason I didn't download the files for Lampant and Chandelier's Feather Sprite. You know, I think I would have had a brain cell to think, oh, if I'm gonna use a Lewick, oh, I'm gonna eventually be using a Lampant and a Chandelier. Damn, that's from 14 years ago, that's crazy. It's just a little bit crazy, what am I doing? It's a little bit funny. It's feeling inside. We don't have the licensing for the song, shush. You're the one who started it. And I'm finishing it. Are you getting that Pokemon to evolve or not? I need to fix the overlay. Oh. Sorry. Oh, that was good. Fucking shiny Pokemon, I think. I still find it so funny that people just send off shiny Pokemon and then not take their thing in their pocket. I'm like, why do you not want the thing in their pocket? Yeah. Just take it home with you and then let it go. Let it die, what is that? let it die, let it travel like up there. Pichu. Do you know people who get Pichus, who get Pichus off of me and then send me something kind of normal? 
All there, I'm there's nothing I can do about it. It just happened. All I'm thinking of now is Moulin Rouge. Hmm? Moulin Rouge? Or is it Moulin Rogue? Is that song in there? I haven't seen that movie in a long time. I, do, I will never forget, though, whoever... Uh, what is it called? I've never, I've never heard of that film. Some Lizzy song or something. What is it called? That's gonna drive me nuts. Have I put a tab in the Discord specifically about talking about music? I don't know. I love music movies. They're great. I don't. What am I getting for this fan fee? Fuck all, probably. A shiny boyzo, because I'm gonna lose my shit. Is it yellow? No, it's Chinese. I mean, it's yeah, I either get, I either get Chinese yellow. or Japanese Pokemon. Which is fine. But I have a lot of them already. Fine, lie down a little bit. Yes, maybe lying down would be nice. I really try not to kick you over, cat. I'm so sorry. There we go. Moulin Rouge is very good. I did go to watch Moulin Rouge, and I forgot that they took it off Netflix, so then I ended up watching the movie with uh, Cher and... what the fuck is her name? Oh, I got a Haunter! Another one! Pug ears! That means you'll get a Gengar. I meant to say Gengar when I... I said Haunter when I meant Gengar, because I'm stupid. Oh, it's just a regular Gengar. Crazy. Get out of here. All Give right. Up a no. Next encounter, it'll be an entire route dedicated to nothing but ice types. So, it might not be useful at the moment. So hold okay. on to it. My next encounter will be. Mountain. Dupes claws, because I've already got frost slash. Like I already have this Pokemon, so people keep sending me decent Pokemon. I'm like, why are you sending off this decent Pokemon you have? For why? Why are you sending it to me? What is the point? Ooh, Mike's gonna be happy. That's snum. What I get for this other fan thing? <laughs> I think I have more, <laughs> but I'm honestly not sure what I do have and what I don't have. And I have a bunch of duplicates, so once I start running out of fancies, I'm just gonna start sending other stuff. Snom is quite hard to use, isn't it, in a Nuzlocke? I have- oh, his name is Ninvender. I'm definitely getting a fucking shiny. Is that another fucking shiny bullshit again? Probably. Yep, Pokevan.com. What's in your pocket? Booster and that's the other thing that they keep putting in there. That's what the Paradox Pokemon used to get a power up. Mm. Get out of here, because I, I don't want you. You can go up there, because I do not care. Do I have any more fan I do have more fan fees. Let's go. I think I, I should. Send more fan fees. What should I name a male snom which might become a frost muff in the future? Uh, ice cream. It has to be an animated character. Like an already established animated character. Fuck. Um. I was gonna say what. 
what's I was gonna say what's the name of the guy from from the th from Ninjago, but I don't wanna copy things, yeah. Zane would have been good though. Because that's the only thing I can think of. Um, what about? S I'm gonna think of something, but I can't. Not another one of these. Silver, as in Sonic. No. Is he ice themed though? No, he's more like. If it was a psychic type, then he's, that'd be perfect. He's just a dude. He's just a dude. Just dude. Just a random. I just keep getting random level seventy-five. Pokemon, and I don't know what to do with them because I'm probably not gonna use them. But they're uh, just sort of there. Shigara no, Shigaraki's the guy with the hands. Uh, what's the name of the Fire Ice guy in My Hero? Shoto? Should I name it Shoto? What, what gender is it? A male. Oh yeah, go for that then. If it was a Galarian Darmanitan, then that would make so much sense because that's a fire and ice type. But that's a version exclusive. Is that, is that for sword or shield? Sword. Hmm. Uh, is that okay. a shiny Greninja, you fucking maniac? Keep that to yourself. In um, Pokevent.com. Pokevent. Crazy. Vent all your troubles by giving away your best Pokemon. Oh, there's a shell. There's a shell bell in there. I'm taking that. So, um, just this box and then get rid of some of the shiny stuff. Tier one, you having a good day today? What? I think now we should run because I feel if I come down, it's gonna come and get me. It honestly feels but like Vaporeon has been doing so well during this, ever since I evolved my Eevee, though. Hmm. Stop giving me your shiny Pokemon, I'm just gonna let him go. Two Pokeven.com is the same fucking thing. What have you got? Heavy duty boots. I will be taking those. For some weird reason, Kira, your mic is spiking. You know you're really oh. hard to hear. That's, no, probably because I don't have a great microphone. I can't help that my headset is like right under my mouth. Try and move it. Is that better? Yeah. Oh, that is so fast. What the fuck? Will right, this be a normal Pokemon, or is it going to be okay. fucking crazy? So we'll be planning to get the ice gym done, get the two encounters from the wild area, and then we'll finish off for today, and then we'll pick up again on the next Saturday. What the fuck? Okay, so we have Can it get registered? Yes it is. Buggers. 6, 12, 13, yeah. I got the box of my Pokemon right. Well, I did get a normal Pokemon, which is nice. I'm playing with my cat. She's trying to kill the plastic bag my food came in. Yeah, that sounds like a cat. And now this is the part where people with cats will talk about their cats. My cat is currently sleeping on my bed. She just feels like it. I get out of the bed, and then the cat goes, I want to get in the bed. And I go, I want to get in the bed. How are we going to cope with this? And she goes, I don't know. I'm sleeping here. No, I'm not here to buy, I'm here to sell, because then I've got a lot, of, a lot of money to go to the really expensive clothes shop here. What the fuck is that? What is that? What have you given me? What the fuck? Oh, Pokemon.gg. Fuck you. It's better than just Machamps.com. I know, but it's always something I already have. There's Saluna, I guess. 
I get a lot of these and people do what I do and they take the stuff out of it and then they send it off again. Well, yeah, but, but you don't want to keep the thing that's hacked, do you? No, 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 no. What they do is they send off the Pokemon and I'm like, cool, I'm getting rid of that though. Yeah, luxury balls do sell for a good bit of money. Alright. Time to make this character look really expensive. Are you sure about that? I have done a disservice to myself. No, oh, Arcane Arm. There is something I forgot to do ages ago. What did you forget to do? I forgot to put glasses on her. Oh, silly sausage. And the only- Oh, Pog that's going in the register. The only glasses that are accurate to my own are the ones in the first town. Well, that's a little bit crazy. This whole time my- my character's been running blind. I'm running around, can't see shit. Just like, just like the player themselves, they can't see shit. No one can see anything. Oh, look at those purple down there. Now they look like a female name. Oh god, I'm just like your Pokemon. I'm setting. Crazy man. I'm setting Tori up to do another gender bent version of myself again, aren't I? I mean, most people all sell for a lot, and then when you do sell them, you're like, why do they sell for so much? What is that? Oh, it's another Pokemon. Another po I meant to say another. Uh, can't remember what I was gonna say. Elephant. I got an elephant for an elephant. You mean a Kaparaja? Yes. But it's Japanese and getting traded away. Okay, let's see what really nice things they have here. I think the T-shirt can deal with that another time. Hmm. I know exactly what the t-shirt is I'm gonna wear. It just depends on when I'll not get that. I hope. Oh, who am I sending this to? Am I gonna get a fucking shiny? I feel like I am. No, spoink. Okay, that's fine. I have so many spoinks I can just start trading them. And there's Lek. Where are you from? Japan? Oh no, they just named them Lek. Okay. Crazy. Let's go for fur line boots. Like get rid of all you shinies. Some blue. And uh, a navy back. Back. I'm not in the final. Ooh. This might be the last of my shinies. I don't actually know. Could. Oh, could be. Oh, they need to connect the ten. I don't trust those. What the fuck is that? That has to be shiny. Oh, yep. Oh, I like that. Yeah, I, 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 I like the way this looks. Oh, apparently I didn't have a Feebath, so that's fine. If it has a Marvel scale on, you'll, get also, you'll also get a Milotic. Oh, and it's leveling up. <laughs> There's nothing I can do about it. I mean, well, there is, but I don't care. Eh, shiny Milotic. Sure, oh, I don't care. Okay. I think I know what I need to do to solidify that I'm gonna win this. Emily will be carrying through the first sections of this, but then when it comes to her bringing out her Lapras, Toxers, they'll come out. And, and there is something I have been keeping from everyone. What is that? And you have nothing too, that's great. Okay. 
stones. I already have a dusk stone. So now we have a chandelier. Really? Get out of my fucking house. I feel like there's another shiny in here and I'm going insane. Well, obviously when I first got Lampen, I thought everyone was to be expecting that I would have already given it to her. Let's see if there's a do new I item have more I can Yes I do. And tattoo. More shiny bullshit. Do I have more? Yes, I do. I have so much more shit. Okay, I think I have five more shinies that I can free. Me thinks. Hmm. I don't have that many moves that um, Chandelier can learn. Okay, I Not lied. I have nine more shinies. I ate every. Oh god. Oh look, it's espresso depresso again. Actually, we'll leave the encounters for next time. Make make some insane to start off with. So yeah, this will be the final thing we do for tonight. Yeah, uh, today, I mean. Okay, I think I'm finally run out of fun things. Mean things. Yeah, I can't do that. Okay. Nope. Just let Mike know that we got his favorite blood type. Um, okay, so um, there is a small problem with this gym challenge and the controller I'm using. There's these pits that you have to avoid going down, but mm -hmm. you won't get told where they are, except the rumble in your controller, and the controller I'm using doesn't have a rumble function. Oh, well, that's fun. So it's literally a case of. I thought it was a bunch of messages being like, hey, you did great. <sighs> Last gym of the day. Probably the easiest. But before I do. You hope. It's the ice gym. I've got the fire type, I've got a rock type. I don't know if I've been sat there. Um. Gee, I wonder why Melanie's your favorite, Taiwan. I wonder why, Shakar. What did I get? Oh, cool! It's another one of these! Can't fucking do shit with it, though. But yeah, Talk is gonna be my main check to that Lapras. Well, at least you're honest about it. What level is it? 14! Great. The 
pick up the damn thing. Okay. What the fuck is that? That's why it's hard to use a cross move. Just trying to figure out this this fucking cross fight. Is this fucking working? Communication and a different error. Try the damn Pokemon. I'm not gonna have a problem about using a status move. Now I burn your gorilla. Why did you put them on over there now? What the hell? I don't know why it was in one and then only seven. This is the only concern I have of this gym. Hey, if it, hey, if it did admit it'd get more um, opportunities to use the bald, bald sponge properly. Yeah, the main reason why I'm worried about this is Lapras does have a reputation for being one of the bulkiest Gen 1 Pokemon out there. Maybe I'll get something normal for what? <laughs> the fucking shiny Pokemon. What do I get? Oh, the Okay, that's fine. Okay, I'm good. Roar Bell's a problem now, but I think we're good now. I thought if I switch and then it took the other side, I was like, what are you doing? What am I getting at? 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 Kings t evolving into Espeon Potters. Oh, yeah, it's your favorite evolution. Yo, Espeon. What is it? 55 on here. Sounds like a Final Fantasy move.
so far because of my surprise strike that I'm now on a different ledge that I started on. <laughs> oh no, they're having to match the 13. I'm getting a fucking hacked in Pokemon. There we go. Yeah, what the fuck is that? Oh, I don't actually have that yet. So that's kind of fog, actually. So it's kind of cool. Oh, it's evolving. Okay. And with that, we're done for the day. I think this has been the sharpest turnaround I've ever seen when it comes it's to cool. this That's Nuzlocke, because cool. I was really in a really hard place at the beginning of the episode. And I managed to yeah, take... You killed so many of them. So I've managed to take down, like, f three gyms come back and I've only had made that to make one change in the team. That was actually Pog. Pokemon are crazy. And the team does look pretty good right now. It does look kinda cool right now. It is a little bit it is a, it is a little bit cool. But that being said, it is time for me to finish. I hope everyone enjoyed watching the stream, and I'm, I've been very grateful about everyone's company. So tier 1, thank you for joining the chat, thank you for following, and thank you for joining the Discord. I hope you'll enjoy your time here. And Kira, thank you for the company and involving my Baldor. Involving your what? Your ball, my Baldor. <laughs> your what? I said Baldor. You mean Cole? Yes, I'm rolling coal. Okay. <laughs> if I I'll give it a name if you won't use it. That's a recurring issue I have, alright? Just won't call it by its name. Alright, for all the new people here, um, I'll be streaming again every Friday, every Saturday, and sometimes every Monday. Friday will mainly be revolving around shiny hunting, mainly through Dynamax Adventures these days. If people like to join mm. in and do that and help me get the shiny noodle boy, it's much appreciated. Bone meringue. I'm not shiny24.com. Fuck you. Unlike what Kira is bumping into, I actually legitimately hunt my shinies. Yeah, well, I'm just trying to get rid of these fan fees. And every Saturday we'll continue with the Nuzlocke, so next sa this Saturday coming up, we'll continue from here. Get some new encounters from the wild area and the next route up. And then we need to face Piers, which shouldn't be a problem because it's dark types and now we've got Grimmsnarl. That being said, Grimmsnarl is technically a king. <laughs> king is technically our only check to dark types at the moment. Unless I get cold body press, which I might do off camera. In fact, let's get the dialogue out of the way before I go. Yeah. Oh, look, here, it's your favorite uh, character in this game. What is it? Sonya. <laughs> oh, yeah, I love her. She's great. Right, now I can sort things out off camera. You got anything. But that'll be it for today. You no bullshit. Get out. Thank you all for today's stream. It's been great. And uh, you might want to keep an eye on my YouTube as well because it might show up there later today. There you go. But yeah, um, that'll be it for today and I will see you later on in the week. See ya.